Bismillah salatu wassalam ala rasulillah. I just wanted to mention this um, narration when the Prophet وسلم, he came pr- back from his hajj. And before going out to hajj um, in Medina, what had happened is that there was an outbreak of smallpox or measles. And so a lot of people got sick and they couldn't go to hajj with him and who, who had wanted to go. And so he, when he came back, he said this. He said, in Umrah in Ramadan, Umratun fi Ramadan ka hajjatin ma'i. And subhanAllah, it's, um, and they, they reason why he says that in the narration. He says, tatiyiban, wa dharika tatiyiban li khawatiri man takhallaf. This was to, to soothe the hearts or to make happy um, like the hearts of those who couldn't go. And subhanAllah, when I was, um, I was tell, telling my kids this, I just said, who of you couldn't go on hajj? And, you know, of course, we, with the Prophet ﷺ, of course, we all raised our hand. And, you know, the point is, is that it wasn't just for those who are in Medina. <laughs> and this was, of course, his last hajj, right? And he knew this was the farewell hajj. He had given indications as this is, this is his his last hajj and he's going to pass away soon and so subhanallah he is saying that for those people in medina and beyond and he is saying that for those people like us who didn't ever have that opportunity to go and hajj with him but he sallallahu alaihi wasallam there's we have that key that you know if we go do an umrah in Ramadan, it's like a hajj with him. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us that risk, give us that risk of doing an umrah in Ramadan. Ya Rabbi, Ya Rabbi. Wa ma dharika ala Allah bi aziz. Please, those of you who hear this, make dua for me, my family, that we get an umrah in Ramadan. And may I pray that those, all of those who've, who hear this, and uh, they also get that risk of going to Umrah in Ramadan. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen.